Mahuri ya uchaguzi na mipaka nchini IBC imeendelea kukosolewa vikali baada ya kuahirisha uchaguzi wa gavana uliotarajiwa kufanyika Mombasa na Kakamega Agosti 23. Wagombea wa gavana wa Mombasa Abdul Samad Sharif Nasir ODM, Hezron Nawiti wa VDP na Hassan Omar wa UDA wanasema hatua hiyo inakandamiza haki za wakazi wa kaunti hizo mbili huku akitishia kuwasilisha kesi mahakamani ili kushurutisha IBC kuandaa uchaguzi huo haraka iwezekanavyo kulingana nao IBC haikuwahusisha washikadau kabla ya kuahirisha uchaguzi huo kwa mara ya pili Nafikiria kwamba IBC is an independent body and they're supposed to make correct decision on behalf of Kenya but it look like it's a private company which can wake up sit and make a decision on behalf of Kenya it's a shocking and what I would like to advise him is only appointed by the Republic of Kenya for the people of Kenya to manage election to standard which is required to the Republic, the people of the Republic of Kenya. So I'm still having a shock and I'm already consulting my lawyer. The constitution is very clear. Article 180 says that the county governor shall be elected on the second Tuesday of August after every five years. Then the laws of this country, the election laws are equally very clear. Article 55B, Section 55B, there are only three ways that an election can be postponed. One, in the event that there's a serious breach of security, that those elections cannot be held. Two, in the event that there's a natural calamity, and in this instance it's an act of God, that means if there, there, there is an issue of, uh, of uh, uh, floods or anything of that nature. Three, that there's a breach in how the elections are conducted. We are going to court, and we're going to demand because there are only three instances where an election can be postponed. One, in the event that there's a serious breach of security. Let me ask you, have we had any incidences of violence in Mombasa? Nothing. None of those people, none of those staff members have even said that their lives are being threatened or anything at all.